Yo. Hi, yo. What's good, everybody? We're back at it again with the Hopakong Chiefs po Baseball Podcast. I think that's our name, Chiefs Baseball Podcast. It's Chiefs Baseball Caca Podcast. Yeah, official. we back. We back. Caca. <laughs> we back here. So, this is episode two. We were supposed uh, to have a special guest today, but he couldn't make it, so he'll be plus, he'll be here tomorrow. Plus said, said nah, I'm doing that shit tomorrow. So we we got our guest tomorrow. We got a guest lined up for tomorrow. We're gonna make a special. We're gonna yeah. make a special tomorrow, Thursday, and Friday. So we're all booked up. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> uh, um. But uh, today's topic, you know, probably gonna be probably be sports. You know what I'm saying? So we're we're going with some sports. We're gonna talk probably baseball, probably basketball. Yeah, and football. Don't forget about that. I don't know, like a little bit. I, I don't a little really bit of know everything much about football, to be honest with you. <laughs> I'll, I'll just I'll just fill you in. Don't you worry. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I mean, you could you could like teach me. You know. Teach the football ways. I guess Sarah play Madden. <laughs> No, we, no, we don't talk about that. We don't talk about that. Bro, I give everybody in that class answers. So John I, McCartney, it's my yeah, boy. The other one. Uh, oh my John, God, John McCartney. Yo, I'm almost on the green already. Wait, no way. I'm actually about to go in the sand. Okay. Oh, that's way too fat so, of a shot. Obviously, golf is not my sport. Um, oh yeah, uh, me neither. <laughs> that was pretty bad. I'm not gonna lie. That's why it's the Chiefs baseball podcast and not the Chiefs golf, golf podcast. podcast. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> no way I make that, right? Keep going. Oh my god. Oh, watch! Okay. Wait, you may, wait hold on. An, hold inch, on. an inch. An inch. An inch. An inch. An inch? Damn, that's tough. So, we're going to go over, um, like, we're going to go over ba some baseball. Basket some we're going about basketball. Basketball, because basketball is not going on right now, so we'll do, like, order, I guess. And then baseball. Right, we'll go over the off season. I guess we can go over the off season. Yeah, yeah. Cause it's, it's gonna start in like a little bit. Oh, look at my my player is so funny in this game. Oh my gosh, my finger just slipped. <clears throat> I'm gonna go in the motherfucking sand again, bro. I'm in the rough. Diamond in the rough. Oh, diamond I... in the rough. Oh my god. No, I was Wait, not planning I go, on that, Mr. Announcer. I'm gonna go with the five hybrid. I'm gonna hit that one. Oh, that okay. is. Wait, that is too far. That was way too far. Wait, don't go on the path, cause that's OB shizzle. Okay, so today, you know, it's gonna be basketball. So, and obviously sports. I'm so retarded. I keep repeating the same Just thing. Sports in general. I mean, we're sports probably gonna go with some basketball. So, so baseball. All right, so let's just let's just um, start. Uh, listing our favorite basketball teams, so uh, I'll go first. You know, me's, me's, uh, mine is the Boston Celtics. You know, my uh, my dad's side of the family was from Boston, so you know. Yeah, cause you're a little op, bro. You're a little op. All right, all right, calm it down, you're pal. A <sighs> little Boston fan. He's a Red Sox fan too, so everybody be clowning on him in the comments. Wait, clowning on me is crazy. Oh my everybody better be clowning. You in the comments Wait, for aren't, your little Red Sox type behavior. Aren't you a Yankees fan? The Yankees I mean, lose. Like, wait, no, Yankees have more World Series. Shut up. Oh wait, wait. When like baseball was created in someone's backyard, yeah, that's what I thought. <laughs> All right, back to the topic. So, Kaden, what's your favorite team? Uh, wait, are we still talking about basketball? <laughs> yes, we are still talking about basketball. Alright, bet, bet, bet. So, you already know, I'm a, I'm a Sixers fan. Um, there's really no reason behind it, to be honest with you. It's just like the first time I actually watched basketball, is just like my dad put on, like, the first game that was on. And it was the Philadelphia 76ers. And I'm like, I don't know, these guys is kind of it. You know, that was like the Ben Simmons, like, that was pre- Ben Simmons Prime? Pre Jimmy Butler. Pre Jimmy Butler, oh, yeah, okay, pre Jimmy okay. Butler. So I was like, I right, bet they're kind of cool. And then like when I got 2K18 or whatever, I was like, 2K18. Yo, let me play with the Sixers because I remember like this Joel Embiid guy and this this Ben Simmons guy was pretty cool. And then I don't know, they've just been my team since then. I don't, I don't know, I don't know. I was born into the household of chicas and chicos. Uh, I am not Spanish. <laughs> 
but you know. Yeah, this, I, this bro is Italian. Like, what are you on? <laughs> so, basically, you know, I was miserable when the. I was actually crying when we almost came back. I was like, not gonna lie, shed a tear, or like 18. So, uh. <laughs> Yeah, it's a very emotional night. We're about to make history, but you know we suck. So, <laughs> and we also we absolutely crapped on Philadelphia. I don't know what to tell you on that. Wait, guy. Wait, they just crapped the it bed. It was a seven-game series. James Harden sold. Although yeah. In the first game, James Harden sold. Oh my like. God. So James Harden's don't a fat the loser. Gruff. The gruff? Yeah, James Harden's a fat little boy. So, uh, other than that, you know, Other than basketball. that, the Sixers, like, suck. Uh <laughs> <laughs> Joel and Biggs, uh, fraud for MVP in the postseason. Um, Wait, you're actually a little boy for that. He Okay, maybe, maybe in the regular season he deserved MVP, but in the playoffs he sucked. Exactly, no. Playoffs he sold. Our entire team besides like Tyrese Max he sold in the playoffs. Oh yeah. But like wait, that just triggered a core memory of like when Mike Scott hit that like one shot to have us beat the fucking Nets or whatever in the first round of like twenty nineteen. I don't know why I just remember that. But like we would have lost against them or something if Mike Scott didn't fucking hit that one shot. I don't know why I'm thinking of that, bro. You know what oh, I'm my thinking? God, I just hit it into the desert. Nice. <laughs> oh my god, I'm stuck. I'm what sucking today. What so what I'm thinking is we were saying since we had to do the draft since we were doing the draft opening day of the NBA last year. So we do a ba ba uh, basketball draft and we do like a draft for everything. But basically, yeah, cuz we do we do like fantasy. We do fantasy baseball, fantasy basketball, all that. So our basketball draft the stug couldn't get in. Um so yeah, we, um, I was talking about how marching band is shit. That's another reason why marching band is shit because you miss your your boy's fantasy draft. I know. You should just put it on like auto draft and put that in your pocket for real. No, I did put it on auto draft. I got like Vlad and um, who else? I got Vlad, Bo shit. Like I actually didn't have a bad team. I know. Yeah, I, I forgot what your freaking baseball team was, but yeah, I mean, you know we still know, undefeated. Might... Your boy's still undefeated. I have like a power Bro, team. To see the whole like season's over. I think he went on un like undefeated the entire year. Oh my god! Because I, 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 even in the playoffs, I don't think you lost once. It's, we're still not over. Oh my god! It oh, keeps rolling. Me. Yeah, it might be like the championship this week. Yeah, because I I got like fourth place or whatever. Oh my god! <gasps> Wait, this is going and this is going. Oh! My I just made like an 800 foot player, bro. Uphill. Okay, wait, this is gonna go in, this is gonna go in. Wait, watch, watch clip this. everybody. Not him. Oh my, oh my goody goodness, oh my goody goodness. So, my, uh, so, basically the story I was going on was, um, basically, I, it was like the first day, and the one guy couldn't get in, so we had to do it the next day, and I remember watching the 76ers game, because I can't see Boston, because we live in Jersey, and so you know that's how that works. So I only can watch like you people around us. I, I'm gonna be honest with you. I just pirate over here. Actually, no. You have to cut that out because that's illegal. <laughs> yeah, wait, like, this guy. I just pirate everything. That's what my dad does to. That's what you used to do to watch uh, yeah, the Redskins. No. That's a, yeah. No, that's what my dad does for the Seahawks. <laughs> But he got like the end, the NFL Sunday ticket, so there's like a million dollars. Oh damn! Oh my god! I just made that. That was like a f 89 foot putt. Probably wasn't. Probably that was like valid. Four. All right. So basically, I saw Tyrese Maxey. I'm like, wait, Tyrese Maxey's kind of a dog. I'm gonna draft him. That's gonna be like a like a like like a like I mean, a. And I was mad about that, bro. I wanted Tyrese yeah. Maxey so bad. You little Sixers fan. A little fucking Celtics fan, bro. Sold the finals, mm. sold the finals. Mm. Sold the finals? Sold the finals. Last I checked, you weren't even in the finals. Like, nah, 
you? Yeah, because the 76ers are ass, bro. <laughs> we always choke the second round. Okay, no, we would have won the finals 2019 if Kawhi Leonard didn't hit that shit, bro. You cannot lie. We cannot oh. lie. <laughs> Kawhi. If Kawhi, Kawhi is no, a demon. Kawhi didn't hit that shot. We would have won that. We would have won that. Kawhi's a dog. Kawhi's a dog. Wait, to L M B crying like a little boy. Kawhi's a, uh, a little boy for that. Oh my goodness. Damn, that was that way too hard. hard. Yeah, no, because I thought, like, since I was going uphill, I'd have to hit that further, but I don't know. But, um, you know. I, I, I don't play golf, bruh. I drafted I don't Tyrese. Play golf. I drafted Tyrese Maxey, you know. I had him my whole season. And he was pretty tough until he got injured. Then he got injured again, and then he just got me, like, five points, and I have on the bench. And then in the yeah. playoffs, he was doing good, though. Yeah, no, he was the only person on the team who didn't sell the playoffs, bro. He was actually doing good in the playoffs. But, Joel you know, Big was, like, only good in the regular season. Joel Big is crazy. Joel Big. Have you ever played basket, bros? That's what his name no, is. No, I know. So, it's like jo Joel I'm Big. Joel Big and then James Hardhat. Yeah, Jamie Hardhat, Jamie Hardhat. Oh, my God, I'm so crap at this freaking game. Oh my goody goodness, wait, I just hit the sand twice in a row, what the flizz. So, um, let's talk about baseball, let's talk about baseball, let's talk about favorite teams, you know, stuff like that. Okay, uh, well, both of our teams are ass. Yo, wait, 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 yeah, for real, we're both eliminated from the playoffs, wait, so let me just say something, let me just say something, I, I you know Miss Volpe, like, like, the, like, the aide that, like, comes and watches, like, classes, if, like, the teacher's not I, in there? I think She's, like, white sure. hair, she, like, waddles around, she's really nice. Not the one with like the, the really like hey. sharp teeth. She's scary, but Mrs. Volpe's really nice. So Mrs. I asked Mrs. Volpe, I'm like, by any chance, are you related to Anthony Volpe, shortstop for the Yankees? And she's like, <laughs> I, she's like, I wish, but if I were, I wouldn't be here right now. I'm not gonna lie to you. <laughs> and I'm like, gosh darn it, cause like I'm not gonna lie, like I would take a picture with him and be like. You know, like his story is like cool. Like he was like he was like us. Yeah, he was like us for real. That smacked. Oh my lord. Wait. Oh my goody goodness. I went 381 yards. Your shot. Mine went like two, 290. Give me that shot. No, that's way over. No. How do you upgrade your my player in this game? I'm just rocking like the absolute base my player. You gotta get monies. You gotta play my career. Wait, there's a my career in this game, bro. Yeah, and it's like you just gotta there's do like golf. My career for golf. <laughs> yeah, it's golf NBA 2K. Wait, no way! I didn't make that. That was so close. All right, so, so close, we are so going close. to freaking talk about baseball. So let me just. I mean, you know, you go first this time. You go first this time. I'm my first year NBA. Okay. Um, um, basically, you know, I'm a Yankees fan, and like, the Yankees to, to be honest with you, I haven't even been watching them that much this year, because it's like hard to watch them. Because we are so ass, it's hard to watch. <laughs> like, bro, I swear, I was watching, like, I was at like the fucking grotto, you know, the, the pizza place on oh, yeah, the top. sticks. No, you should yeah, like ask me grotto. to come over one time, and we can like go to the grotto and eat together. It's yeah, be so bet, tough. Bet, bet. but you, you was paying because I do not know how had no money right now. <laughs> oh, God, I got oh 20 God, bucks. in the water. Give me that. Chat. Okay, I'm going to go from here. I'm going from the crowd. I'm hitting from the crowd. No, I was at Grotto, right? Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. And they had the Yankees game on. And, bro, it was so hard to watch. I only got through, like, it was um when we played Toronto, when we played the Blue Jays. Like, oh, so it was, that game was so ass, bro. Like, the Yankees are so trash this year. I think, like, no. The first two innings, everybody struck out, I'm pretty sure. I don't think anybody got a hit in the first two innings. Might not have even been in the first three innings we didn't get a hit. Like, embarrassing. Oh, no. Yankees oh are just fat hard to watch this year. If you take anything away from this episode of the podcast... It is a difficult time to be a Yankees fan, bro. <laughs> yeah. Don't worry about the Red Sox, though. All right, so I'm a Red Sox fan. Um, we all so Red let's Sox just are selling this year too. So yeah, like... so we're both trash. Good luck here. Um, <laughs> but you know, all the Yankees can talk about is how they have more uh, 
more um, World Series they have when uh, the guy who made baseball <laughs> was playing in his backyard with like two people. I know, it wasn't even real back then. I mean, like, the Yankees' name I mean, was wait, like. You're literally a Celtics fan. Stop talking. Stop talking. You're literally a Celtics wait, fan. Wait, like, the, the Yankees' name was all like. Ju- it was like Jew York. Rings. You got all of your rings. Bill Russell's a dog. Bill Russell's a dog. Don't talk Bro, to you me. You got all your rings when everybody was like 6'4 besides Will Chamberlain, but Will Chamberlain played on a team of fucking bums. Name one person on Will Chamberlain's teams other than him. Wait, Will Chamberlain was not Jerry real. West. Wait, he was like not a real person, I swear. Wait, plus he literally like basically single-handedly defeated the Celtics that one time. That one time. That w- yeah, no. One time no. keyword. Still, he played on a team of bums. When he was on the Sixers, I could literally name nobody that he was on the Sixers with. That's how much like that's how bad the people he played with were. They are not memorable at all. They were all bums. He carried that team, bro. In the arms of Bill Russell, let's have a moment of silence. In the arms arms of (laughs) Will Chamberlain was not a real human being, bro. I don't think he existed. Will Will Chamberlain was a goat. Will Chamberlain was a goat. Oh my god! Until Michael Jordan, until Michael Jordan, and then he was just like, I am out. (laughs) (laughs) LeBron was just like. I'm here though. And then right. LeBron was just like, I am not the goat. <laughs> he's just, he's just like, I'm 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 just existing. I'm second in line. LeBron was just like, I want to be the goat, but I'm not the goat. <laughs> mm, what are you saying to me now? If he had better shoes, then maybe. He had better shoes. Then 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 he would be the goat. I mean, hey, Michael, jo- you know, when you say Jordan, you either think of Michael Jordan the player or you think of Michael Jordan's shoes. Which LeBron, is not but, the same thing, you know. So like, I say it's Michael just like Jordan Sweet King LeBron. Aspect. Michael Jordan got him in that aspect, you know. So uh, back to baseball. And this is about oh yeah, I forgot we were trying to talk about baseball. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Oh my God, my seeds. Um, <sighs> okay. you, cousin. Thank you, sir. Um, but uh, yeah. So baseball, you know, not going very well. Yeah, it's not going very well for either of our teams. <laughs> yeah, I mean, we're out of the playoffs, but yeah, it's okay. It's okay. It's okay. <laughs> the giant keys <laughs> loose. So, you know, when I was in Cooperstown, you know, I had to purchase that big poppy jersey. 140 bucks. It's hanging up right next to me. 140? No, when I was in Cooperstown, I bought a, a Rocky set, you know, because cause CR, you know, had to get it for the initials. Of course. But, like, that shit was, like, $50 for, like, a, a little fitted hat I could have got for, like, 20 at Liz at the mall. No, like, Liz is, like, a million. Liz is, like, so bro, much. No, I go to Liz all the time. I got, like, three of my Yankees hats there for, like... I got them for le- like no less than thirty dollars. I got just my. Gotta get them on sale. I got my one Red Sox hat from Cooperstown. It was forty five bucks. And then I got my <coughs> one. It was like it was like the military hat, and I was off Fanatics. Oh yeah, I know which one you're talking about. Yeah, the Red Sox hat. It was a flat it's brim like fit. It's the camo him. Red Sox hat. Yeah, kind of, sorta. Yeah. I got yeah. I got a picture of Big Poppy and Andrew Benintendi literally framed on my wall to the right of me. I have oh, a Jason tough. Tatum. I have a Jason Tatum jersey to the right of me. I have a Big Poppy jersey to the right of me. I have a Michael Jordan jersey to the right of me, All Star jersey, and then I have a Paul Pierce jersey also to the right of me, hanging up. Paul Pierce. Paul Pierce was a dog. Besides that one time that he like had to shit, so he like faked <laughs> it. I remember. I remember those like videos. <laughs> I'm like, too, bro, wait. And then I have a Celtics. I have like 18 Boston hats and like like it's like three Celtic hats behind me. I have one has the Celtics logo in a diamond. Oh my gosh! I don't know how the hell I just did that. You know it's Cooperstown. I got your poppy jersey. You know when I when we uh, my, we might go to like I want to go to Cooperstown Actually, again. No, we were like talking about how Paul Pierce shit his pants. That's what we're talking oh, about. Oh yeah, that. Paul Pierce <laughs> crapped his pants. In the middle of a game, he faked an injury because he, he had the crap, but he still denies it to this day. 
No way. I thought he he like admitted it one time and then after that he just like denied, denied, denied. Yeah, he was just like uh, he like didn't want to be like that like exposed like that bad. Ready up, cousin. Yeah, he didn't want to get exposed like that. Yeah. Ready up, cousin. Yeah, I'm back. All right, go. Yeah, All right, like. No, did you go to that when you were in Cooperstown? Did you go to that one store? Where I I don't I forget what it was called, but it was on like um like Main Street or some shit. It was like across from like that brewery. I remember we went to that brewery. I had like some fucking gin or whatever. <laughs> but anyway, yeah no. So like we was we went to that store across the street. That store literally has like four rooms and they're all wall to wall with shit. Like they had one room that was like a shit ton of basketball. I they think had, like, so. Two rooms of baseball. Yeah, yeah, you know what? The, yeah, you know, like the main, the main room where you check out. It's literally all the walls are just hats. Hats is cray cray. You know the store I'm talking about? I think so. They had, they had a, they had a Hillary Clinton, uh, Joe Biden, and a Donald Trump, like Barbie doll, like outside of this <laughs> store, and it was a bunch of like freaking politics stuff, and they were like selling it. That's funny. And then they had this one baseball card store. It was so overpriced, but I got some baseball cards. And guess what I got? It was like a four. It was like a twenty-five dollar pack of baseball cards, and it was like one of those like it was like a, a chrome mosaic, and it was just like it was just so trash. Oh my yeah. god. Okay, wait. So back on topic, we're gonna be going off of a baseball. I mean, there's really nothing else to say about baseball. Um, yeah, I mean, cause both our teams are ass, bro. Oh god. Maybe we could talk about like the playoffs. Who? Oh, wait, who do you want to win the playoffs? Who do I want to win? I mean, I, I like the Blue Jays. But they're probably not gonna win. So I mean, I'm gonna say Toronto, they, but they're probably not gonna win though. Are they in the playoffs? I don't even know who's in the playoffs. I'm I'm pretty sure. Yeah, I don't really know who's in the playoffs to be honest with you, but. They're you know, probably gonna be in the playoffs because they're like a good team this year. Playoff oh, no, I bracket. Just like, I just like Boba Shit, so like. No, I don't want. Yeah, that one. Oh, we gotta put this pack. They are. They're going against the Rays. They're going against the Rays? Okay, yeah, I do not want Tampa to win. I don't know why. I just have like an irrational hatred of Tampa. So, so it's so, saying, so saying, it's that they're the wild card though. Blue Jays. So I'm Blue Jays, Blue Jays win. here wait. So, going to, though. so Blue Jays oh, Blue versus Jays Tampa win. to uh for the wild card to go against the Orioles and then whoever wins that um has a locked in to go to the World Series and then uh, going against Houston and the uh, Twins going against. Whoever wins that goes against Tex the Texans, and then whoever wins that goes against whoever wins versus what I just said. And then the other side is the Cubs Brewers. Oh, I hate the Cubs. I don't know why I just hate the Cubs. And then Diamondbacks and Phillies going. Since since I model my stance after Ronald Acuna Jr., I kind of like the Braves, I'm not going to lie. Or LA, cause my boy Mookie, you know Shane Bloom, he's gone. Shane, get out of here. Who names their kid Shane? He, is, he lives in Sh Shane. He li his name is Shane. Bro, Do I see Shane? <laughs> so, I either want um. I want, I want the Orioles, the Braves, or um um Dodgers to win. Like the whole thing, uh, cause I like Adley yeah. Rutschman. I have my fans. No, I'm gonna things. say like Blue Jays. Blue Jays or, are or Houston. They're in the wild card because they do not even have a spot in the playoffs yet. I know they're in the wild card, but like still, I like rooting for my underdogs. You know? Yeah, yeah. If the Yankees like aren't in, if the Yankees aren't in, then I like rooting for my underdogs. I like I like the Phillies like everybody everybody like makes fun of Cole for like the Phillies but like I like Bryce yeah, Harper. No, I hate the Phillies. Everybody Cole likes the Phillies. <laughs> I, I I like the only thing is I like Trey Turner. I like Kyle Schwarber. Kyle Schwarber, my boy, I love you. Mwah. 
Well, yeah, Kyle Schrober's a dog, but, like, everybody likes Kyle Schrober. And then Bryce Harper. Everybody hates Bryce Harper. The Bryce Harper is a dog. Like, I don't know what y'all talking about. No, he's a dog, but I don't like him. I kind of like Nick, Nick Castellanos for, like, no reason. Nick Cas Castellanos? Yeah, I I, 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 like I, I love those Phillies, too. Like, I just, yeah, like... the Phillies <laughs> team just doesn't look like it'll work on paper, but it just does. Because they have, like, no defense. I love... Wait, I love Bryce Harper, though. Like, Bryce Harper is an absolute demon. Like, I don't know why y'all, like, hate him so much. This guy this guy is me riding Bryce Harper. Like, right Blood's now. villain arc was crazy. Like... Blood's <laughs> villain arc. <laughs> I got even par. You're five over. I'm a demon. All right, ready? I'm going to turn up. Lock in. Blood is turned up. Oh, my... So, um, yeah, let's uh, switch off uh, to um, football here. So, basically, football. All right, well, you're going to have to carry football. Let's see. Last week, <laughs> last week, the Broncos yeah. got turned on by the Dolphins. By the, by the, bro, 70 to 20 is crazy. Like, I mean, how do you mean that? Isn't that the most, like, scored in a football game since, like, 1960-something? I think so. Because... Remember the Giants got turned yeah, on. Yeah, the Giants got like seventy three, in like ancient times. I don't know, just like the Yankees, but like the Yankees were even fast. It's just like the Yankees, the Yankees. Bro, shut up. Red Sox are just as ancient, bro. No, Wait, whoa, they're whoa, not. Okay, no way. All right, so uh, let's recap. So Sam Howe. Sam Howe's leading the league after four in interceptions thrown in last game. Even though it's all right, he, he was just out of it. You know, he wasn't locked in. Okay. In summary, Russell Wilson's mid after he left the Seahawks. <laughs> um, but you know, the Seahawks took a dub. I'll be, I'll be respectful yes, sir, to the CS just because of you, tough. just because of CS you. But tough. if Mario were to be here, I would like kill him. <laughs> oh god, wait, no, like, oh. Mario is literally just, like, defacing all Seahawks fans, like, Mario like he actually, like, he actually makes me not want to be a Seahawks fan, because that's literally all he talks about is Seahawks, like, he, don't he talks about football, and he's white, and he's, like, really white. He's literally, like, paper white, have you, <laughs> if you've ever looked at, like, a paper before, that's what this bro looks like. <laughs> Like, and and all he talks about is like Seahawks and he does not play football. Neither do I, but he yo, like I made that what the flizz? <laughs> what the hell? So I don't play football, but I could play football and Mario's just like a puny little yeah, kid. No, because my boy Dylan's actually like tough like that and he's actually big and strong because he drank his milk as a kid. He drank my I never drank milk, bro. <laughs> he drank his milk as a kid. He Bro, did your dad like ever tell you that like if you drink milk you get like big and strong and shit? No. Like, no. I, t I feel like everybody said that like, bro, drink your milk, you get. Big did you? And did your parents ever say that to you? No, I saw that shit on like TV, bro. <laughs> Same. I'm a. Uh... Oh, I got an eagle. Wait, I'm him. I didn't realize I was eagle. Wait, I'm so good. Okay, wait. All right, one foot putt, guys. Oh, oh my gosh. <laughs> Alright. I think we should end the podcast after this. Like. Uh, I did not spell anything. Yes, sir. The podcast. The podcast. After, uh, after this. There is um, not a lot of funny moments. We need, to, we need to get some funny moments. Yeah. I don't know. I mean, sports talk is just not supposed to be funny. It's supposed to be serious. Yeah, like manly man type shit. Yeah, yeah. Wait, Nat's gonna be mad at me because I like didn't text her since like six, bro. It's like ten. <laughs> cause this, the, cause the, the ma, the Mama Ronda. Ma, Mama Ronda stole the phone. <laughs> <laughs> Who just said meet me outside? What? <laughs> that was my dad. <laughs> he was yelling yeah, at my dog. Some smoke. <laughs> Bro, yelling he's smoking it. with your dog. <laughs> <laughs> Not my friend, but my actual dog. Wait, you see that? <laughs> no. 
<laughs> no, have you never seen that clip? It's so funny. It's like, I love my homies. That's my dog. <laughs> not my friend, but my actual dog. I don't know, bro. It was, it was funny. <laughs> Wait. <laughs> hey, yo, I got that. Oh, yo. I got to tell you about my, uh, my, uh, my Spanish project today. So... Oh yeah, so, you had the expert. All right, yeah, I'll let you talk about it. I'll let you talk about it. So basically, I was like, I kept saying George Chai or Caesar Chai, and oh my god, you know like Louise? Wait, before anything, before I say anything. Oh yeah, the kid, like the who, little kid girl. who stalked me. Kid who stalked me. Kid who stalked me. Yeah. The little girl that looks like she's like two. That thought she had a glow up, or <laughs> is like weird eye shadow to school. Yo. This one. So at my like my pitching program that I go to. This one guy named Will Ryan, bro. He's like, I don't know. He's like tall. He looked through. He's like he throws like mid eighties as a junior. He, yeah. he he just became a junior like this year, so. And, bro, this guy's actually he's like a crazy like like mullet kind of like he not like a little like mullet but like flowy hair. He kind of mm. you ever see that like, Coach Rack? Maybe. If y'all know what I'm talking about, he looks like him. And he like he has these two like baddies as his lock screen, and when he gets when he gets notifications, everybody just looks at his phone because they see like, like I remember like the one time it was like who, it was like someone was like whose phone was that? I'm like yo, I'll well, be Will's forever. And he just has like two, but look, he definitely pulls bro. Yeah, I mean he got two baddies on his lock screen. But anyway, what you, what was you talking about with with Bubble Butt Girl? <laughs> Yeah. So, <laughs> bro, that's gonna be your official name on this podcast now. Is Bubble Bug Girl? <laughs> no. So we were doing wall sits, and then she said she can beat me. So I was like, all right. So we were sitting there for like one minute and thirty seconds. Like it was like the I don't know, it was like one minute, but like that was like the longest wall sit I've ever done in my life. And um. Like she beat me, but she's like, she's like, wait, you better win this. You gotta get a big booty for her. And she started laughing, and I was about to be like, you too, but like, I don't want to be weird. <laughs> I mean, hey, well, if they compliment your booty, I mean, like, you know, you kind of gotta compliment the back. You know what I mean? You know what I mean? Oh, 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 oh. She was looking for that validation there. I mean, hey, bro, it's still the beginning of the year. You know, it's a scouting period right now. So, the scouting like, period. <laughs> It's a scouting period for hoes right now, so like, yo, you wait, gotta, you gotta stay on our radar. You gotta stay on our radar. That's all I'm trying to say. Stay on our Worse. radar. Stay on our radar. And Miss Wait, Mr. Miller's so annoying. Like Queen trying to keep over and come talk to me and like just like, and, cause like, and he would like yell at him for like come over and talk to us. Really? Like, yeah, he was actually so annoying. That's why I hate fat gym teachers like Paul Miller. Like, <laughs> like maybe you should be doing the physical activity we do if you're fat. Gosh, oh dang. god, wait, he just likes to see bubble bubble. Gosh. <laughs> like if you're a physical activity, like a physical education teacher, and you're like not like, and you're like big, like it's yeah. just like. No, like Mr. Brown's fine because Mr. Brown's yeah. like built and yeah. shit, but like Pillar, Miller, I almost said Pillar Mall. Miller Pillar Mall? Paul, Pillar Mall. Miller Paul is not it like that though. Oh gosh, wait, and like Mr. Andalina, like he's like, he's also fit too. And then like the, like the track lady, or whatever her name is, fitness lady. Mortensen? Yeah, Mort name Mortensen. Yeah. Like Mr. Paul Miller. Uh, what else am I thinking? Oh yeah, so back to my project. We, um, what am I thinking? <laughs> So she she was presenting her project. It was it was her and she had she had like this like famous soccer player guy from like the nineteen fifties, like nineteen sixties. Yeah. And um she was on like the family slide and everybody was talking because like no one really cared. That like that she was presenting or whatever the hell. Who this is? This is Louise. Right? Louise, right? Yeah, 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 Louise. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And and she um, <laughs> so embarrassing. She. Okay, mom, why are you yelling at me? The heck. And um, 
she um she was reading and it was like a family slide and it was a picture of this guy's daughter and she was so bad and then <laughs> and then she was like everybody was not paying attention because they were talking about like their daughter and she was like <laughs> she was like she turned around and pointed at the whole class and she was like yes is that right and she was like and everybody's like uh yeah and then and then and then she's like that's what i thought and then she went back to freaking like reading her slides she's so weird for that bro wait no like it's so funny though because like i sit behind her in math right and like i don't know you know how last year she was like stalking me and shit she was like weird as hell she was like you ever see um yandere simulator you remember that shit from when we were kids which one? Like you ever see you ever Yandere Simulator? You ever see like Jack Seth's guy play that? I like, feel Corey it, maybe. Kenshin? Maybe, maybe. Yeah, no, she she was like that girl, bro. Like the <laughs> crazy, like creepy girl talking about like her dreams that she had about me. All right, anyway, anyway. What? <laughs> topic. Yeah, no, on God, that happened. No, and like I couldn't even pay attention in math class because she'd be staring at me the whole fucking time, bro. And like I couldn't even like when I would leave math. Like, I actually had to have, like, a squad of boys around me to make sure, like, she wouldn't follow me out. Because she started, like, waiting behind so she could leave at the same time and, like, try to talk to me. Ew. Like, bro, she was so weird. But anyway, like, after a while, I was like, bro, you gotta stop because it's getting, like, wild. I was like, I don't care if you like me, but, like, don't be weird about it, I. And then, like, since, I, since she's in, in front of me now, right, in um, math... Like, mm -hmm. whenever she has to, like, pass papers back and shit, she, like, drops it on the floor. Like, she don't even hand it to me. Like, I remember today, like, she, like she drops it, right? Ooh. Yeah. But there's, like, a gap in between our desks. So she literally dropped all the papers on the floor. And I'm like, Plo, what are you doing? Did you say that like, to her? <laughs> yeah, no, I literally did. I said, what is Plo doing? <laughs> <laughs> It was so funny. Yo, do you have Miss, like, Miss Senorita, Miss Senora Maltesta as a uh, Spanish teacher? Or do you have yeah, the other lady? Have, yeah, So, I have, I have so, her. when, when, when she did that, Miss Maltesta started laughing. Laughing at her? Yes, everybody was. <laughs> And then, and then, and then she, then she made like that face where she was like, she was like, what the heck is she saying? She was like, like she like raised her eyebrows and she was like so like shocked that he, she said that and then and then she was like I, I like then she walked up after she was like done she was like uh, she was like all right miss you can go sit down i like the way you take initiative <laughs> <laughs> bro you know what you know it's bad when the teacher's laughing at you bro. Oh, <laughs> all right crips so that's that's the end of our episode today um, I don't know. We talked about sports. We talked about whamming. Uh, whamming. Uh, oh, we, uh, we talked talk about, about this one whamming. girl. We talked about bitches. Uh. Yeah, um, I gotta make sure my girlfriend never sees this channel after I was talking about that one girl. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, but anyway, anyway, anyway. Um, yeah, we got a guest star for tomorrow. We got a co-star for tomorrow. It's gonna be lit as shit. I promise you that. I promise you that. It's gonna be lit. Um, I don't know, what are we, we going to do tomorrow? We got a game plan for that yet? No, we probably not. Really? You know, just expect anything. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, we just going to like wing it or something. I don't fucking know, bro. Um, are you ready yeah, for this feature? This, been, this has been the Chiefs uh, Baseball uh, Podcast. This has been the Chiefs Baseball Podcast. This has been your co-host, Caden. And my co-host, Dylan. Dylan. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Uh, we'll see y'all tomorrow. 